Hello everyone, Zane here and welcome back to my channel. Hope you're having a great day so far. In this video, I'm going to show you guys how to upgrade your Sky Sung tool for crafters to a Sky Builder tool. This is going to complete the Sky Steel tool relic upgrades. Alright, for Shadowbringers. So, the first thing you want to do is, of course, equip your Sky Sung tool. Next, go to the Machinist Guild, talk to the same NPCs as before, and you will be accepting the quest, Oddness in the End. After the cutscenes, you'll be transferred to the Firmament, and you'll be dealing with these three people here. The Spanner will be dealing with the Ali Delicate Materials Exchange. So these are going to be four-star items. The lowest collectability is going to be 2500 to 4499 The mid-range is 4500 to 6499 and the highest is going to be 6500 Each one will give you one, two, and three Ali Delicate parts respectively all right if you're looking for the highest which is 6500 i would recommend watching ash's video he basically goes through the process of getting it for me we're going to be dealing with the 2500 to 4500 range all right i will link my video on my gear and my melds for you guys but you also can do this with the hand saint script here as well and I do recommend doing this with a specialist. With extra stats, CP, and of course the careful observation. So my stats with the chili crab and the red syrup for control is 631 CP, 2657 craftsmanship, and 2861 control. Now the materials are going to be from the diadem, and yes, this is going to be dealing with expert recipes, unfortunately. So these are going to be from the Diadem, and these are going to be from Sky Scripts or Yellow Scripts. Just like I said in my prep video. And you're going to be needing clusters. Alright. So let's go ahead and start this. So like I said, I'm going to be dealing with the 2500 to 4500 range. If we're lucky enough, we'll get 6500. But we're going to be going with the lesser for faster times. Alright, so the first thing we're going to do is muscle memory. Inner quiet. Manipulation. Race not two. We got a good, so what we're gonna do is intensive synthesis. Otherwise you go with veneration. So pop veneration. And then do groundwork. These twice. If you didn't get that good, you would do it three times. And then delicate synthesis. So that takes care of your progress. Now for the quality. If you get a good, go ahead and use precise touch. And then apply innovation. We got a sturdy, which is good, so we're going to go with prep touch. And then when waste, two, uh, waste not two falls off, we're going to start doing prudent. Reapply innovation. More prudence. Trying to get at least 11 stacks of render quiet. Because I'm getting a lot of sturdies, my durability does not reduce as fast as it used to. Alright, so we have enough CP for a precise touch, but we need to make sure we have enough CP for careful synthesis. And most times, where if your durability is pretty much low, you Pretty much want to make sure you can complete the item and without 7 CP you might not be able to do it so be very very careful but since we do have enough durability I can do precise touch and we got another good so I'm going to take the CP and another good take the CP again all right so we do have enough room for more prudence And I think we're going to stop right there for now. So then we're going to be hitting 4,500, definitely. Unless we get a good, then we're probably going to hit 6,500. So great strides. Innovation. Now if you like, if you have a specialist, you can do careful observation to beat out a good, which I'm going to do now. And there it is. Perfect. Make sure you have crafter donations, by the way, which you can get through scripts. So Baragats. 
And we got the 6500. Perfect. So now we can just do careful synthesis, which gives us 673, which is more than enough to hit 1049. And voila. So there's really no set rotation. I just kind of follow the same starter. With a little bit of adjusting to the conditions. So here we're going to be hitting intensive since we got it good. The most optimal is, of course, getting a good width veneration up. Just like that. <laughs> so do an intensive again. Do a groundwork. Alright, so we're run away. So we're not going to use delicate because we'll complete the item. So what we're going to do now is activate innovation. Got apply it on prep touch, which is good. Got it good, so go ahead and use precise touch. Do another prep touch. And now we're back to doing prudence. Getting sturdy and prudent is like very, very good because you'll be able to reduce it even further. We've got another good, so that's perfect timing. Alright, let's finish this craft. Let's try to bait out a good again. There it is. Fire gots. And another 6500. And we got a intensive synthesis proc, so let's go ahead and use that and finish it off. Alright, so basically my way of doing it is try to get the minimal and then try to bait out a good. If you don't get it, then you'll just get two. If you do get a good, there's a good chance that you'll get 6500 to get a three. Alright, I believe this is the only step that we actually have to do to get the last upgrade for this. So I'm confident that we don't really need to do anything else besides this. Right, so like I said, that is my way of doing these recipes. If you want to see Ash's version, definitely go check out his channel. So, shout out, shout out to Ash himself for doing it that way. But I feel like doing it this way is quicker, it's more of a set rotation, but we're just adjusting to the goods, and basically, that's about it. All right, guys, so that's pretty much going to be it for this video. Thank you so much for watching. Don't forget to leave a like if you found this useful. Any comments, questions, and or concerns, please put them in the comment section down below. I'd be more than happy to help you guys out with any questions you might have. And of course, don't forget to subscribe to my channel if you're new for more Final Fantasy XIV Shadowbringers content. And as a reminder, make sure to hit the notification bell next to my subscribe button. This way, you guys will never miss an upload. So until next time, may you forever walk in the glorious light of Lord Bahamut. Take care, guys, and good luck.